this is a brand new season of Big Brother. It's the first of its kind. How you doing? Shut up. Eat. I'm from Soweto. My name is Em. Big Brother Titan, first of its kind, and kudos to the selection team because these housemates are fire. They all came with different kind of vibe, and the selection fantastic. We have both the Gen Z, the Millennium, and let me not even say the Pampas, but someone was giving a kind of President of Africa vibe, right? <laughs> anyways don't forget to tell me in the comment section who gave you the vibe you needed remember it's too early to start shipping it's too early to predict who will win so for now we are just enjoying the whole vibes and fashion wise mm, i don't know I don't know how to rate them in terms of what they wore to the stage anyways but they all brought vibes a kind of unique vibes anyway so the opening show was such a beautiful warm nice performance doing both the south african and nigerian song kudos to the organizers and then kosi being the first to make it into the house and she started trending immediately <laughs> even some nigerians were saying oh congratulations to james brown ah no now that's not nice that's not nice at all but she says she's here open to you know try a new culture the nigerian culture she can't wait for the food <laughs> and getting into the house for her is another way of achieving one of her goals all the best to her we can't wait she seems so lively and open nearted and all that so we can't wait to see what Kosi brings to the house and then the next housemate to enter was Yemi First of all, what is the sleeping? I would say, well, I'm recording Very cute, tall, a kitty Lagos boy and he said he's open to, you know, learning the culture learning people as well <laughs> I know you'll be wondering oh this face looks familiar if you watch the previous big brother niger he was in one of the commercials for a particular fragrance i know i know you'll be wondering where do i know this guy from where do i know this guy from anyways fine boy we wish him all the best and here to see what he brings into the house Next housemate was Juicy J and he said he loves food and he can't wait to try Nigerian food. <laughs> Anyways, his personality such an interesting one and man, let me not say what's on my mind but I know for some of you your eyes were definitely somewhere else. And the next housemate being Olivia from Nigeria. Olivia mentioned that her highest achievement in life is being a landlady, meaning that she owns a land in Lagos. And when asked who she will miss, she says she will miss her mom and she will miss her phone as well. And when asked if she wins the money, she said she would like to use it and help the needy as she has been there before. All the best to Olivia. And then Nelisa, she said she's attracted to trouble. She's always the main character and she loves guys that are dark and handsome. She says she's single as well and open to adventures in the house. It's quite getting interested. <laughs>
then a black boy he said he's adventurous he loves cooking he's from nigeria as well from jaws and very attentive he mentioned he's a content creator and will be bringing a lot to the house okay boy and then the beautiful wana from kaduna state she was beginning to give me diana vibe a kind of sasuke vibe you know that's african queen petite fine girl and in fact i love the selection for this particular um big brother and honestly i can't wait for the show to start digging in okay and then followed by ipe Lang. The tall gorgeous queen says she's in the big brother house for the experience that she has always wanted to experience being a housemate and now she's here. She says she can't wait to try Niger jollof rice. She's open to learning more about the Nigerian culture and mixing up with Nigerian housemates. And then came Mervyn with the seas pack guys. This one brought in Niji like his own vibe. Being a fitness guy from Buttercourt, Nigeria, he said his mom is a fan of the shoe and she's always telling him, you know, to try the shoe. And that he's now in the house and can't wait to experience all that the house will come with. He said he's even open to dating as his mom won't mind him bringing a girl from the shoe hey JP mentioned that she's a nurse she loves to party she loves looking good and that she's open to everything the house will be bringing she even mentioned that she loves cuddling and if one comes her way in the house she will definitely indulge in one and she said never say never she's open to every ever in the house i got my eyes on JP <laughs> and the next person being Yaya here is the absolute life of the fucking party. Okay now. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then Ibubu from Anambra State, Nigeria, dude came with his own very smart vibe and I love that. He said he's open to falling in love. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, Ibuka even advised him to keep his eyes on the prize. Well, why not if love happens why not and i've already picked interesting ibubu and let's watch meanwhile kayla came in i want to learn um you know most times when to speak like english and everything he mentioned he's not so good with people but he would definitely try his best to live in peace and harmony in fact, this one is giving President Vibo and he said he's here to win the money that he stays his turn. Amy <laughs> That it is his turn and he knows and he's here to collect his money. Anyways, I'm rooting for him or he said he's a straight shooter, life of the party, but they're not good with people. And then Jenny O from Imo State, Nigeria, she mentioned she'll be the chef of the house. Like the white money of the house, that she loves cooking and she's a very good cook. She also mentioned she's stubborn and a risk taker. She said most times she doesn't even wear her risk, she just dive in. Anyway, all the best to Jenny O. And then Tasto, I don't know if I got the name right, but she said she's a bio bioengineering student. She's combining two courses, but then she's ready to be a star. I love the energy she brought. Like I'm a student, but I'm here to shine, and I'm definitely rooting out for her. I love her energy. I love her energy. Like 
maybe this one will turn out to be my fave anyway it's too early to have a fave but i got my eyes on her kana got one of or if not the most energetic housemates tonight this one came with both south african and nigerian vibe like he was giving us the boat slang i was like ah ah bros calm down it's plenty but dude said you know he's here to win the money and he got the energy and the vibe as well and i'm definitely rooting out for him okay and then justin came in because representation matters he said he's excited being on this show because he barely see people like him on the reality show and because why not representation matters he's here as well and i'm super excited for him he actually you know gave a shout out to his people he said he came from a very small village a very small town okay and i'm definitely rooting for justin as well right now watching give them a shout out boy what's up here and then the last but not the least housemates the beautiful yvonne from Aquaibon state nigeria and she said most time people see her as a competitor maybe because of the way she carry herself and she barely humble for people but then people see her as a threat anyways we can't wait to see her in the house guys it's it's hot go ahead and tell me who gave you the vibe you needed who was your best dressed for tonight and remember it's hundred thousand dollars that is at stake this season and their house is so beautiful the whole interior deco it makes sense and remember don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and do well to like this video and share as well if you can enjoy the rest of your day and i'll see you in my next video bye